Hi everyone, I'm Wilsonator and welcome back to Rust. That's right, we're back on the beach once again. I did not get raided, actually, uh, but I was a bit sick of that area that I built in last wipe. Uh, I was a bit bored uh, because there wasn't really many people living around me. I had to like run across half the map to get uh, some PvP action. So what I've done is I've uh, I've waited. It's a, a map wipe right now, um, and we've just logged in. There's loads of nakeds around. I'm literally on right at the start of the wipe here. Anyway, here we are. Let's try and uh, fuck. Can we just swim across? I'm kind of tempted to, to just swim it, man. All right. Well, we're swimming across the ocean here, and uh, we're gonna try and try and head to like these sort of areas. Where else do we want to build, man? Oh man, I might, I'm I'm kind of tempted to build somewhere around this area. Um, maybe near the sewer branch or something as well as like a lesser monument. It's quite a good area or even up there could be cool You could definitely do like a bunker base or something up there in like the uh, the shallow area I don't want to build in the desert though. The desert trees are so broken man Like they haven't fixed the the tree mini game on them yet. So they're still completely fucked when you try and uh, Harvest them so I don't want to build quite there But maybe we could build like around this area just above it. That could be good And we're also pretty close to the oil ring if we go there I hear someone. Oh, fuck. Oh. <gasps> got him. He nearly got me, though. Holy shit. Did we get his bow? I, I left his bow. I'm just gonna leave it. Fuck it. I'm running for it. Um, we did get a little bit more resources off him, so we can get a hatchet. And we'll get a pickaxe once we get a bit more wood. Um, but yeah, let's keep running. We're kind of on track for where we want to be going. We want to be heading probably down through the desert, but we don't, like I said, don't, I don't want to live in the desert just because of how horrible these trees are. Like those ones are so bad to farm. All right, we're getting a pickaxe and we're also going to get a tool cupboard. We're going to need a few more um, trees though before we can build a base and preferably also some food so we can get our health up. Uh, if we run towards this river, we should get some pumpkins and stuff from there, though. Okay, I think we're kind of ahead of the curve, though. Um, maybe maybe not many people have been out here, because look, the, the barrels and stuff aren't looted. So, some fire arrows and stuff. Um, might ignite that, actually. There we go. So we have a fire arrow at the ready if we need to use it. Bit of rope. Another bit of rope. Uh, honestly, that'll do. Um, if, we wish, if we just want to get like a, a little bit of armor, that should be good. All right, we've got a little bit of uh, animal fat. Not bad, I'm gonna get a bone helmet. Okay, let's continue our mission here. Um, I'm kind of tempted to go up to this forest up here and farm a bit of wood. Uh, we're very close to the excavator actually, um, which is quite cool. And there is a road right here, which we're about to cross into. I wanna be careful around the road just in case anyone is like up on this sort of area. Okay, we're not gonna need too much wood. It's just uh, stone maybe at this point. Uh, there should be some stone nodes around here, though, I would imagine. We're in, like, the, uh, we're in, like, a hillside, so I imagine, yeah, look, we got, that's metal, I think. running. Fuck, I should have used the normal arrows on him. Holy shit, those horses are fast. The great horse escape of 2019, eh? That's, that's what I just witnessed, I think. Ah, okay, so one thing we have a little bit of a problem with is cloth at the moment. We don't have a great amount of cloth, so we might have to hit some cacti and just collect some like that. <laughs> oh, one shot. Lovely. All right, so we've got some stuff now. Uh, so how many, how much scrap do we have? We have 90, so we do have enough for our level 1. Um, let us get some low-grade fuel. We're going to want probably about, I don't know, like 20, 25. That would give us enough for two furnaces, which is all we really want for the time being, I think. Really good start so far, actually. Um, we've, we're only like, what, half an hour into the wipe, I believe. And we have a base, we have our furnaces. Um, well, we've got one furnace currently. All right, so while I wait for this to cook, I'm just going to head out and try and hit some barrels and stuff. Maybe get some more trees and whatnot. Uh, and then we should be able to get a revolver soon. Uh, and I also want a compound bow. Uh, people have been saying, like, uh, for scientists and stuff, the compound bow is the best thing to use against them. 
and then maybe we could even hop into the excavator and try and kill some scientists and get a few things like, I don't know, components and scrap and stuff off of them. Oh, there is a guy there. I don't think he's seen me. Let's try and keep it that way for now. Oh, he's seen me now. Ow. Got him. Oh man, this guy was kind of loaded. Not bad. That was actually quite good. We got we got a bunch of stuff off that guy. So I might go into the the excavator with a compound bow and try it out. And if if we can go through the scientists there, then I might try the oil rig with it. Uh, we may die doing this, uh, but it doesn't really matter. We're not losing like anything amazing. It's just I'm just kind of. Seeing, seeing how good this is, how effective the comp. Fucking hell! Oh, hit him in the head. Didn't kill him though, I don't think. Hit him in the head as well. I think you have to be closer to one shot them with it. We we're making them run away though, but when they come back, they should be lower on health. Oh, he died. That was another one I must have hit already. Some pistol bullets and pipes. See, this is what I'm talking about. You can get a few bits and pieces off these guys. Look at that over there. Holy fuck. This is where we really want to get the headshots. Can he shoot me from that far? I don't know if he can, you know. It is kind of slow. How many of them are there? I mean, I must have hit some of them like twice now, right? Because look, we're hitting them all so many times. Okay, that one's dead. Oh, fuck. They're rolling up on me. Oh fuck, they're rolling up on me big time. Fucking hell. I'm nearly dead. I think we're dead. I don't think we're surviving this one. Oh yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> Is he dead? He's dead. We only have 23 arrows left, so not a huge amount. This one has an arrow in him. It's like I, don't, I feel like it's it's so difficult to get to get like a shot on them without them shooting you first. Like they seem to always be able to get a hit on you. Oh, I heard one. Oh, he's right there. Need to get some meds off them, man. I make more bandages off their bodies. This one dead. See, it's like most of them have tagged them at least once. So there should only be a couple of shots. There's another one dead. Where? There's one down there. Oh my god. Another one dead. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Oh! Is that my body? Yes. Okay, I think there's only one left in here. Maybe. Nope. Is he dead? I don't think I did kill him, you know. He's following me? That's more like it. Holy fuck. Okay, that makes this whole thing a bit worth it. <laughs> Get a oh, Fuck me, no! <gasps> I'm hoping this is literally the last one. If we can just grab that Tommy, then we're good. Can they hear you, like, running around? I don't know, man. I've always assumed they can't actually hear you. He's right there. He's there. He's there. Please don't tell me you're coming this way. Oh, you are, you fucking bastard. Fucking hell. <laughs> oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, you son of a bitch. He's above me. Oh, he's coming. Oh, my God. How does he just know where you are? That's so stupid. He just knows exactly where you are at any given time. Hey. Where was it? Yeah. 
fucking bitch. Sit down. <laughs> wow, that, that last scientist pissed me off. <laughs> I don't know why. It just... Uh, oh, fucking hell. Okay. I think that's all of them. I think that is all of them. Chop this piece of shit right up. I need that bandage. I want to recycle some of this stuff we've got here for scrap. I also want to check all of these extra uh, bags that we may have missed. There we go. This was very stressful. I think in future I'll just do it with a gun. <laughs> with the Thompson though, this should be good. Fuck yeah, 320 scrap. Um, that's what I'm all about. All right, should we um should we head out of here then? I'm feeling more confident now. Um, if we come back here, we can bring the Thompson, and we'll probably have better luck with it. Oh, I see a guy over there. He's on the other side of that mound, I think. I don't know. He might have gone in the cave. In which case, I might just run home. Maybe. Or we could try and wait for him to come out. I don't know. I'm just going to check. I think he went in here. I, honestly, he was he was milling around outside here. So, he might have went inside. Whoa, that's very bright. Oh, yep, he's in here. Man, that guy must have just had a fucking heart attack. <laughs> oh, shit. I just imagined his reaction there. Holy shit. Oh, God. If I was coming out of a cave with a bow and a guy with a Thompson just sat there in the entrance. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fucking hell. I was way, I was way too careful with that guy. I thought he had, I thought he was geared, but he was just a naked. I got the chainsaw from this, which is really good for getting the trees around here because they're awful to get like manually. Nearly have enough for a level two. I might, I'm kind of tempted to wait until we do have just enough for a level two. Let's, let, let's go. Let's try and get a boat and we're going to try and head to the oil rig, basically. This is really a fast progression um, episode. Like, usually we never get this far, like right away where we've got Thompson in episode one, but... We're bringing the salvaged axe because we're going to probably have to chop up the scientists there for uh, bandages. There's a lot of scientists on that thing. There's a boat there next to that base. Oh, there's a guy there. What's he got? Oh, he's getting fucked up by a dog. This guy had like nothing. I kind of want to come in from, a, from the other angle. Just in case there is someone camping it, which there very well might be. Yeah, look, there's a boat there. So someone has at least been here. And if they're still here, I don't see any scientists on there either. There might be someone here. Yep. Someone there with a bolt action. Oh my god. Really? Holy fuck, I'm nearly dead. That guy's like super geared up already. Got bolt. I think I'm probably gonna die here, honestly. Cause he's he looked geared, like he had coffee can helmet and shit on. And he's gonna be just watching an angle. There's no real way for me to easily get up to him. He doesn't have to do anything, he just has to wait. I attempted to jump down and then climb the ladder. Another guy there. I'm not going down there because he's going to get bolted if I try and loot that guy. He's up there. He's there. He has an MP5, I need to be careful. On the helipad, it sounds like. Yep. Got him. He had some of this. 
Okay, I have to be careful just in case there is any more. His gun fell off. His other gun. What, what gun was it? And did it fall all the way? More meds. It's always good. And diesel fuel. I think his gun may have fallen all the way off. It's just kind of frustrating if it did. Or it may have landed on one of the lower floors. Did I get him? Oh, he, I did. Fucking hell, what a shot. I don't see it anywhere here. Ah, it's kind of annoying. Oh, well, we got we got a whole bunch of shit. So I might just come down now and try and get these extra bodies that we uh, we just killed. Get some fuel. A diving tank. Okay, let's head home. What a fucking amazing start to the wipe for us if we can get this stuff home. Oh, oh my god. Okay, that was that was so good. Holy shit, that was amazing. And we got enough for our level two workbench now, which is really good. Um, so I don't want to get that in this base, so I probably want to wait till we build like the start of our main base. Uh, but what we're gonna do just before we finish off, we're actually gonna go to the excavator now. I think with uh, some of this, I'm gonna go with a rad suit. I think rather than all that gear, because I'd like to research some of that. Um, and we're gonna kill any scientists that are there, and then. We are going to run the excavator for a little bit, get some sulfur, I think. Um, that could be good. And we can see how much we can get. We should get a few thousand at least. Fucking hell. Like, uh, somewhere at Face Punch, they thought, hey, this makes a lot of sense. Huh? This makes a lot of sense. We can just have them just shoot at you when it's pitch black with perfect accuracy. Look at them on top. Okay, we should get some. Some bullets and stuff here. Like, how can he see me? It's ridiculous. He's shooting me through the palm trees, is what he's doing. You see how how they start shooting before they can even see you? It's like they walk around the corner already shooting. <laughs> Him dead. I'm out of meds. I need to be careful. One of the, one another one's aggroed as well. Fuck. Are we good? We're very not good, I would say. Fucking hell. <laughs> I'm scared, boys. That's a big note from me. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Holy fuck. It's coming. I need to kill him quickly. Please, I need meds. Is that all of them? I think that might be all of them, you know. I could be entirely wrong, though. I don't want to get too cocky. And not... I need to just be very careful here. There's our... I might be dead. Fucking hell. I need meds. Desperately. See, I'm not I'm not hearing any scientists anymore, so it might actually be clear. I don't see any. I think we I think we've killed them all. To be honest with you, I just need to try, try and just find all the bags. Should I turn it on though first? That might be a good idea. I mean, high quality metal would be great too, or stone would be good, really good. I don't know, man. I, I want everything. We'll do sulfur for the time being though. Since the, especially with the risk that's involved, like with how many scientists and shit you have to kill to, to get it working. Um, oh well, okay, wrong way. Um, I, I decided to put it to um, to sulfur just because I think that makes things a little bit easier, right? It makes it more worth it, in my opinion, having sulfur come out because you know sulfur is probably the rarest of all those resources. I mean, high quality metal is pretty hard to come by as well, but I'll take these. I can, I can recycle these um, incendiary bullets, right? I don't know what you get from them. I'm actually going to do 
half my buckshot rounds as well here. Because we're going to get some sulfur and stuff back from this. Look. Mm, might get a little bit of high qual and then set it to stone. Um, we'll just leave it on high quality metal for like a minute. <laughs> oh, man, I'm so I'm so picky. Like I wish you could just like say, mind me a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Instead of just saying, instead of having to like choose one resource at a time. How much fuel we got? I've got three. So we've done about half of our fuel. And we've got 1,600 sulfur out of that. So it's not terrible. Um, but I would like to maybe change it to a different resource for now. Alright, so in total from this, we've got 2,280 sulfur, and we're getting some high-quality metal now. Um, we're just going to keep running back and forth between the two outputs here, just to collect everything and keep an eye out for uh, any potential thieves. Making sure that this is all under my control, which is, of course, what we want. Alright, so I've just set it for stone now. Look at that. Holy fuck, that's going up so fast. So we should be getting a ton of stone here, which is good because we want to build our main base um, sometime. Probably, we'll probably start of next episode. We want to probably start building our main base. And uh, to do that, we're going to probably need quite a bit of stone, essentially. So that's kind of what we're, we're trying to do here. Okay, so we have another 1,100. So we, we've got four, six, four, two, four, six thousand stone. We've got 2,000 sulfur and we've got 62 plus 18 high quality metal which is 80 high quality metal total and 885 scraps so all in all definitely worth it honestly awesome so we now have 751 scrap we've got over 2000 sulfur whole bunch of stone not exactly sure exactly how much we have in here but uh, it's a good amount uh, we've got some more gunpowder that's pretty good and a little bit more um, metal frags quite a bit more high quality metal which is uh, of course very nice so i think we're probably going to finish this episode of the wipe here we've done a lot of stuff today we went to well we first of all went to the uh excavator with just the revolver and the compound bow and we got the thompson which is great we also then went to the oil rig and we got a bolt action rifle and we got some diesel fuel and stuff and then we came back to the excavator and uh, went through again killed all the scientists and then we ran the thing and uh, we got a lot of stuff out of it. So uh, all in all, very, very good start to the wipe. Uh, next episode, we're going to probably start building our base. We're going to try and design something and uh, build it and move in. Uh, and that could be good. Um, so yeah, we'll do that. Anyway, I hope you have enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you next time.